Holy crap guys, you're probably wondering where I've been, why am I such a slacker, how come I haven't uploaded in almost three months, what is going on, why is it so windy, hold on. Alright, so sorry about that guys, I have been slacking, I know, I have no excuse for it aside from that I got a new job, um, I'm now a full time MIG welder, and that's what I have been doing, and I actually went to work this morning, um, a couple days prior to New Year's, and uh, the boss man gave me a couple days off. Uh, for the week so which was nice of him and it gave me some time to update you guys and let you guys know what is going on and why I haven't uploaded so not much has changed with the car couple things I got some new wheels here in the rear these are some uh, XXR I want to say they're 968 or something like that they're, uh, they're pretty cool wheels I like them I picked them up for uh, pretty cheap with some tires on there I've got a set of four of those I just have two in the rear along with my squares so that is about that with the car. I broke a tie rod drifting. I just have, I don't know, a couple small things that I ended up doing with the car, um, like picking up a gas tank. This gas tank is going to be going to uh, the shop for cleaning, actually today or tomorrow. But in, the guy that I bought the transition from, uh, Jared, he's going to be cleaning that out for me because, I mean, honestly, I probably could do it this weekend, but uh, I'll probably just have him knock it out since he has the tools and the material to do it. And it would just save me time, and plus it's only going to cost me like 100 bucks or something. So, uh, yeah, I, I've got some of that drifting footage. A lot of it was kind of eh. I'm going to throw a couple clips in there just so you guys can see because I never did upload those and I never really, I don't know, I never really did anything from that last video I uploaded. Uh, you guys got like the last few minutes of it was some tires being mounted and me getting ready to go slide and then, yeah, I left you hanging. So, uh, with that being said, here are a couple clips. Uh, from that and then I'll just kind of run you guys on what's going on for the next year or so because some things have changed with me personally and uh, yeah we can go from there <laughs> he was like a foot away from the curb. <laughs> guys well that last run when I threw it in there I don't know if you guys saw it or noticed it because it might have been a little blurry for my headlights but looks like one of those hoses went down in there she was doing good doing good that was a lot of abuse that second throw bro it was a lot of abuse I'll check in with you guys when uh, we let her cool down Alright guys, so that was a little bit of footage from uh, the past couple weeks. I know it wasn't too much or anything crazy. Uh, a lot of the drifting that I've done has been super low key. I've been meaning to bring my GoPro and this camera out there when I do it. Plus it's just hard to have you know a bunch of people out there and have somebody film and blah 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 blah. But I wanted to just ramble on those uh, like personal reasons on to why or what's going on with me. I'm probably going to be staying in Florida another year, another year and a half because of the job. 
on top of my girlfriend's job she makes decent money and I'm starting to make some decent money down here in Florida and I'm hoping to gain some shop experience welding so that way I can take it back out to Colorado or Utah or the Midwest because that's where I eventually want to live so anyways guys um, you haven't really missed out on too much I know I kind of was really I don't know blah about explaining what was going on with the car like I said nothing too crazy the gas tank I did end up start excuse me I did start to rip apart the spare CA block that I have I'm gonna get this to the machine shop and get this prepped I don't think I'll use it in the car that I have now but I am kinda on the fence on building another car uh, just because I don't really like the way that this car is set up I mean you know I just want a stock looking car the street car look I don't want to have you know a jacked up roof with uh, the metal on oh let me show you that I put the sheet metal back on so hold on give me one sec okay so here's the roof as of right now I don't think I really filmed any anything of it but I redid the roof I couldn't stand the Lexan it was a good idea it just it just looked awful and I mean honestly this looks terrible too but it's much better than what he had on there before and I tried cleaning up the best I could making the rivets you know even and flush I, I don't know I just you know little things about this car that really works my nerve and I would really just like a, a clean simple street car that I can take out uh, not only to daily but also to drift because you know I'm daily in that car right now and it's a lot of fun I really do enjoy it and life's too short to be you know I don't know, prejudice about those things. I really wanted a 240, and I got one, and I enjoy it, but you know how it goes. I want something that is going to 100% satisfy my needs, if that makes sense to you guys. Uh, so, back in the garage here, I just wanted to throw in these last few clips. This is probably going to make the video a little lengthy, but I did end up going down to OSW this past weekend. Today is actually New Year's Eve, so this past Saturday I went down to OSW. I got to meet Adam LZ, uh, Taylor, Ray, um, hung out with uh, Andrew Grafton a little bit. Just a bunch of those guys that are on YouTube down in the uh, Orlando area. It was cool to see them in person, watch them drift, and also to, uh, to meet them. So I'm going to throw those clips in there real quick, and then I'll just wrap out this video when I'm back in the house. And I also... Another thing, my computer is a big reason why I haven't uploaded my desktop. I'll show you when I get in the house, but my desktop actually crashed on me. I have a MacBook and a desktop, and I use the desktop to edit all of our videos on. That way I could just keep everything on my MacBook. That was personal. But that guy ended up taking a uh, crap on me, so I'm editing on my MacBook, which is kind of... I mean, it's, I've done it before, just in previous videos uh, a couple years ago, and it's just a little weird getting used to uh, the iMovie and the, uh, the Apple software rather than using, using Sony Vegas. So uh, I'll show you guys that real quick, and then, yeah, I'll wrap this video up.
All right, we are back in the house. I'm going to wrap this video up real quick, show you guys what my desktop is doing, like my little area here. This is where I do a lot of my editing and when I'm on my computer and stuff. This is the desktop that I have been using and this is what it gives me. It tells me that it's preparing to uh, do an automatic repair. It goes through this process and basically shows me that, I don't know, I can't get to the, the actual um, home screen or the desktop, whatever you want to call it. I've talked to a couple of friends of mine, uh, including Mike, you know, he's a computer savvy guy and they think it could be the SSD or the hardware. I'm not too familiar with these. I can take apart cars and fix things, but I've, I've yet to learn anything about a computer and I really need to because it's kind of important, you know, <laughs> especially that I, I edit on them. But all right, uh, I'm going to make this short and sweet. I'm editing the video now as we speak. Uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that cool content that was from uh, OSW. It was really, 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 really awesome to be over there or down there hanging out with those guys and being able to see all that drifting in person. Two or three more things. Once I get that tank in my car, I get a new uh, harness because now it's going to expire. Uh, 2019, my uh, date on my harness expires. So I need to get a new one of those and then also a heat shield for my turbo manifold to the brake, uh, you know, booster and the uh, actual reservoir there. Um, once that's said and done, we can get ourselves down to uh, OSW and get drifting with those guys. I don't know if I'm ever going to make it to A class, but I hope to get into B class one day and see. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to wrap this video up. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm most definitely going to uh, keep it up and, and try to push content some more. Uh, I know it's a real big letdown. I, I went on that CA splurge, building that CA, and uh, I don't know, i just been slacking. So. Uh, hopefully I can get some good content for you guys within the next couple weeks and start picking up things and we can go from there. Take it easy guys. Later.